How's it going? Just me and my um, my zombie friend here. He looks really happy to see you guys. I think he's a big fan. So, we're back on the server, as you guys uh, can tell. Um, if you missed it, I uh, did a... Hi. How's it going? I uh, did a live stream on the 19th to celebrate the Minecraft uh, five-year anniversary. So... Um, I've done some stuff since we were last together, uh, mainly on the stream. I also play a little bit on my own. Um, well, I did record. Actually, I recorded some videos that I never released um, right before TwitchCon. Um, or no. No, it wasn't before TwitchCon. I think it was before I went to the um, to L.A. for the Minecraft Telltale event. Um, but I wasn't really happy with them, so I decided not to, uh, to put those out. Um, so, here we are again. I'm, I have a slightly different setup, so I have a different microphone now, as you probably can tell the difference just by listening. Uh, but I also, um, I, because of the way my audio is coming into my computer, I'm recording my video just differently in general. Um, because, again, the way the audio is coming to the computer, I need... Uh, sh I've been using Shadowplay. I could use Fraps, like I always have, and that would work fine. But uh, I'm using OBS for everything else, so I figured I could use OBS for Minecraft as well. Um, the reason why I bring this up is because since I'm using OBS, it's really easy just to throw my webcam on as a layer. And so I've done that, and I don't really know. I, I used to always be really against uh, YouTube videos with webcams. I don't know why. I don't have a really good reason for this strong opinion. I just have this strong opinion. Um, I don't know. Maybe it always felt like the, the YouTuber was trying too hard. <laughs> like uh, I was trying to push something on you didn't necessarily want. I don't know. Um... But at any rate, for whatever reason, I've never been a fan of the webcams. Um, but I'm trying to warm up to it. Uh, I think that there's a lot of people out there that really like to be able to see the face of the person that um, that they're watching. I do know that some people get uh, says it takes away from the gameplay. I think that was probably always one of my biggest points when I would talk about it as well, was that it doesn't feel like... Uh, it's it's suddenly now the the video is no longer about the game and more about the content creator. Truth be told, though, I think that that's uh, a good way to describe this series at this point. Um, I don't think you guys are watching uh, for necessarily for for my. I mean, you're watching for Minecraft, sure, but I think uh, or I like to believe at least, and maybe I'm deluding myself here um, that. Uh, I mean, at least whenever people bring up this series, they talk about the stories that I tell and uh, and that kind of real-life connection you have with me as as the reason why they enjoy the series. So I feel like... Okay, that didn't work. Um, <laughs> I feel like that uh, that is that is the case with this, but who knows? There's probably people that still watch just to see Minecraft played, which is kind of weird because there's probably better people to watch if you just want to watch Minecraft, honestly. Um, it's really dangerous out here. So, um, another thing you missed, if you missed the stream, was that um, I lost all my gear. So I don't have any actually enchanted uh, armor anymore. I've lost, I've lost all my gear. I don't know what happened. Um, when I was preparing to stream, I logged in, and uh, I was on a tree, and people seem to think it was up there. I don't really know for sure, but I was on a tree. And there were zombies everywhere. And I thought I got, like, up on a block where they couldn't get me. What I think happened is, uh, um, is a skeleton probably shot me down into range of those guys. And I just... Cause I, I, I tabbed out of my... I thought I closed Minecraft, but I guess I didn't. I guess I had just tabbed out of Minecraft. And, um, yeah. I come back. And, or when I went to log in to start streaming, uh, I was dead. So, uh, all my stuff got lost. I tried to find it, but I didn't know where I even was. It was funny, because I logged in to get prepped for the stream, and uh, I was like, I don't know where I'm at in the world. I have no idea. And um, I was like, well, you know, it would be funny on the stream. I can figure it out. And then I died, and it's like, well, fuck, I don't know how to get to where I was, because I don't know where I was. Um, but what we ended up doing on the stream, well, I died quite a bit. Actually, I walked back towards uh, where we were. Um, I don't know why I haven't slept. There's no one else on. Um, 
walk back towards where uh, t to like the, the start area because again we'd lost everything, so I need to go get new diamond armor. So I started walking back home and um, died on the way to a baby zombie, and proceeded to die to that same baby zombie like four times trying to get my stuff back. It's really strong baby zombie. Um, so yeah, and that is that. So, uh, that, again, that was all on October 19th, which is, if you guys didn't know, the five-year anniversary of this series and Minecraft in general, because this series is where it all began. Um, so, yeah, well, again, we just streamed for a couple hours. We had our T-shirt going, uh, the Teespring five-year anniversary uh, Minecraft shirt, which I wasn't going to mention. Well, I mean, I, I guess I might have mentioned in this video, but it wasn't really a big deal because the campaign had ended. What I've learned today is I have no idea how Teespring works um, because the campaign ended on that in that stream. Apparently, after a campaign ends on Teespring, if enough people say they really want the shirt, they just start the campaign back up again. <laughs> See, like, I thought that this was like this, you buy it now, limited time only, never ever will it be for sale again, and, uh, and get it now or never get it kind of thing, right? Which makes sense. I think that's a good way to do do it. I think it's fun, in fact. I, I like that that whole, like, get it now or never get it type of thing. Apparently, that's kind of a lie. <laughs> because get it now or get it next time it goes on sale when enough people want it. <laughs> Which, okay, that's fine, I guess. It's kind of shitty, too, for the people that bought it thinking, like, hey, this will never be available again. I'm the only person... That, that has it, uh, you know, yay me, I I bought it, and I support it, and never again. I mean, it's cool, I guess it's cool that um, they have that, you know, that option for those that missed us, missed the sell or whatever, the, they can still get in on the thing later on, that's, that's cool. I don't, I don't want to exclude people from it, you know, like for instance, uh, let's say you were, um, you didn't get paid, and you only get paid once a month, and you didn't have any disposable income to buy a, just a you know a shirt. Um, that seems pretty fair to me. That you know, <gasps> fucking hell, holy shit, man! Why you gotta be like that? I didn't hear him hiss or anything. I probably need to turn my uh, game up just a little. There we go. Um, man, blew this uh, log. Words. Right over there. Um, all right. So let's uh, get this show on the road. Um, how do you make road trucks? Is that it? Yeah, that's it. That's how you do. Bam. So my goal was to stream on uh, last last weekend on a Saturday. And to get everyone on with me and let's finish this thing, um, which a lot of people were on board for, and uh, then something came up with me. I didn't get I didn't get one of the parts for my uh, my audio setup in the mail and like I was supposed to, and um, something else happened too. I don't remember exactly what it was, but anyways, long story short, we didn't. I, that stream obviously didn't happen. Fuck, I thought I had stone, uh, the right logs. By the way, some, some creepers have blown up part of our railroad. That This also happened. A lot of things happened in this stream, if you missed it. Um, one of those things was, for the first time ever, I showed the IP to the Minecraft server. I've always complained about people that do that. Like, how can you make that mistake? How the fuck? How the fuck? You have one job. Don't show the IP. And I used to always get mad. Oh, I gotta sneeze. I used to get mad because um, it's like, well, it's not even any work for you. It's all work for me to deal with this after it gets shown. But um, it's like, oh, you, you know, you don't care as much because you don't have to actually do anything. Oh, you know, I don't really think that's true. I mean, I don't think anyone actually wanted to show the IP. But anyways, I used to get really bitter about when people would show the IP. And, uh, because for a while there, it was pretty common. Like, oh, dude, I showed the IP again. It's like, for fuck's sakes, you're fired. You're out. <laughs> um, but anyways, 
And that was my, that was also my other go-to line. I've been on the server longer than any of you, and I've never shown the IP. Well, I can't say that shit anymore, because I damn sure did. I showed the hell out of this IP. It felt like a moron. Um, it was really silly, because, like, we were trying to do an ABBA caving, and we realized we didn't have any silk touch picks either, That's, which was just its own little separate little failure. Um... But uh, we were going to do an avocaving, and Chad was going to come out. Uh, it was me and Michael as well. And uh, we were waiting for Chad to get here. Of course, I'm in the middle of nowhere, right? Um, and uh, I was like, man, I guess I can TP you. You know, we don't really normally do that, but for the sake of the stream. And no one's opt on the server because of crack cam. You know, we'd all get spammed with uh, the, the TP messages that made crack cam work. Um, which, if you're wondering where crack cam is, I didn't want to bring it back until I was finishing coding the game version of it um so it'll come back eventually it's not really something that a lot of people are like chomping at the bit for anyway so i don't i'm not too concerned um that i'm like neglecting this thing while i take my time programming it basically um i think it'd be something fun uh i'm trying to get it ready for our marathon um as well so that if you donate um any amount or, uh, you know, at least like $5 or something like that, you'll get access to the URL where Crack Kim will be at on for the UHC server. Um, but we're still working out all the tech for that. The uh, For those that are wondering, the Minecraft Marathon, if you don't, well, a couple things. If you don't know what the Minecraft Marathon is, um, on November 7th, which is Extra Life's game day, we're going to be doing a charity stream for Extra Life. Um, so all the money raised will go directly to Extra Life uh, to help sick kids in North America. Um, so it's not a it's not a Canadian uh, thing, or I'm sorry, it's not a, a European thing. I think they do have. In fact, I know for a fact they have children hospitals in Canada. So it's a North America thing, not just not a. Uh, wait, this is where I wanted to be. Um, so yeah, uh, it's just not a European thing, which I know we have people that are in Europe, and um, you know we we want to support everyone worldwide, but there's, there's only so much you can do, right? Anyways, tangent, tangent over. Um, so uh, on November seventh, myself and the final count is seventeen Minecrackers. Um, so I think we'd said our, earlier it was going to be eighteen, but it's seventeen exactly Minecrackers. And people have been asking, you know, who 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 are these 17 Minecrackers? And um, I am not going to tell you. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna leave it up to those guys to announce themselves. So if they want, if they want to say they're coming ahead of time, they can. Um, I think it's I think it's up to everyone to, uh, you know, it's not on me to announce. But we will have an announce. I, I will have an announcement video once we get a little bit closer to the event where. Um, we are working out all the different prizes right now um, because it's obviously like if you've watched any of these streams in the past uh, we're gonna have you know prizes for for donors uh, so if you give a certain amount or you can donate to have certain things happen uh, we actually uh, so Wednesday is our um, our meeting night which was tonight and um, I just got out of that meeting in fact and it's uh it's like 10 o'clock <laughs> so uh, that meeting went on for a long time um, Basically, right whenever Chad's stream started, is whenever we finally finished, and it started at six. So it was like a four-hour meeting, just working out the segments, the prizes. Um, there's a lot of people involved to make sure that this all goes off without a hitch, too. Getting um, uh, all the equipment there that's needed, because um, I, I don't think I actually told you guys what it was. I think I told you that it was for Extra Life and it was game day, but. And I'm, I, I guess I'm taking too much for granted. I'm assuming everyone already knows what's going on. But let's let's roll it back just a little bit here. So if you don't know what's going on, I need to sneeze again. I think I have like phlegm in my throat or something. Um, if you don't know what's going on, it all of us, 17 of us, uh, are going to San Francisco, um, and we're going to be hosting a live stream from the Microsoft Loft. Uh, so Microsoft in San Francisco has this loft building that uh, it's an event space. Um, so it's not really made, I mean, it's made for this type of thing, but they normally, it's other uses have been like parties and that kind of thing. Um, and it's normally just during business hours. So it's not normally open like 24-7. So we had to get some special permission to uh, 
to have it open for this long, uh, the main the main concern is the cost of the security and that type of stuff that Microsoft has to have on staff in order to uh, meet their insurance costs and that you know that kind of stuff. It's it's a lot of those type of things. I gotta do something. All right, I'm back. So, ooh, I made myself a little loud. I think. Um, so yeah, there's 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 a little bit that goes on behind the scenes, or not a little bit. There's a lot that's going on behind the scenes to make this event an event. Um, it's going to be the biggest thing that we've ever done as a group by by a mile. Um, I mean, we've done tons of cool things in the past. You know, I, it's been so amazing these five years. Um, the type of things that we've got to do as a group of people. Um, you know, the things that come to mind obviously are some of the parties we've got to put on. Um, if you had told me that one day I was going to ha be responsible for organizing uh, with Namco this $20,000 party, uh, just the event space alone was $24,000, um, <laughs> and that I was going to have to pay for this like, and just like be okay with that and uh, know that the it was all going to work out in the end, like, I would not have believed any word that you were just spewing at me. Like, you you are a liar, sir. None of those things will ever happen. Um, so, yeah. I don't know why it took me five years to buy a better microphone. I don't have any idea. Like, I guess I was just afraid of, an, of the whole XLR setup because it's something it's foreign. And I am the kind of guy that once I know how things are, I don't want to touch them or move them or change them in any way um, because it makes me nervous. <laughs> uh, so, yeah. All right. Got this area kind of lit up now. I'm tired of mobs just coming out at night and attacking me over here. It's really obnoxious. And see, I hear a zombie already. And that's the problem with the zombies, too. You get one, and then you fight him, and, like, 50 more fucking come because of the, the way that they're programmed. We're still in a really old snapshot here, and I know that there's got to be a stable snapshot in between the version that we're on and, um, this is basically Torch Tuesday. Uh, but I don't know what that stable version is, so I haven't updated our server yet. Oh, there's a cave over here. I know, uh, today was a snapshot, and the doc and them were saying that it's got some bugs in it, so I haven't updated today. But uh, I, I read that they finally added the first thing I ever asked Interbone for when I met him, very first time I met him. I probably came across like a crazy fanboy, um, partially because I was. Uh, but, uh, I was like, oh my god, what is the game? And uh, he was like, yeah, I'll look into it. And then it never happened. And I'm, I have it two hearts. I had no idea. You do not want to die. Oh, shit. I ain't got time for you, buddy. I only got two hearts. Please don't hit me. I know why my attack indicator keeps going away. Because I keep using different versions of Minecraft. I wonder if... I need to install. I need to install 175 in a different place than I've been installing um, this uh, this version of Minecraft. Because, like, for whatever reason, I cannot play 175. This that's what we play a uh, gob on. I can't do it. Like every 10 minutes. Well, it was 16 minutes, but it's changed now. Now it's a variable uh, amount of time, and the game just crashes. The Nvidia error. I'm sure you're all familiar with it if you play Minecraft. I think we've all we've all felt it. It hurts, man. It hurts deep. So right, I was gonna sleep. That's what I was gonna do. Keep forgetting that. The problem with this railroad is that um I've been making it always during the day with no one else on the server. And during the stream the other night, there was other people on the server, right? And it it wasn't going very well because of that fact um, that uh, it was nighttime, and this thing was not made to be used at nighttime, basically. So I have to think about that. I mean, I, I had thought about that before when I was uh, 
talking about putting a dome on the whole thing. And then everyone was like, that's a terrible idea. And I was like, yeah, you're probably right. It's probably a terrible idea. So I didn't do it. Um, but we're going to have to really think about that. We're going to have to do something. So I think we're going to start the track back, even though we're almost out of time for this episode. Well, not almost out of time, but we're getting there. Um, we're going to go ahead and start the track back, and I'm not really sure. I was thinking about doing it starting right here, but now that I've started chopping that tree, I think I'm going to change my mind. Let's see here. So we're over here. Fucking hell, this is annoying. Uh, all right, so we're over here. I think it might be best. Because hmm. hmm. the track to the next town, I want it to start from up there, and I want to make a walkway, like, up through here. I, I got, like, phlegm in my throat. It's really annoying. Yeah. No, yeah, all right. Wasn't sure if I was actually muting my mic. I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm muting my mic. All right. Um, let's see here. Like starting from like right here would be ideal, I think. Um, hmm. So from up here, what we can do? We need to make a diamond shovel. We have a little walkway across here. Just use these for now. There we go. And we'll start from like right here. So right here is where we go from. All right. Yeah, this will do. That'll do, pig. Um, so I was uh, I was talking to um, someone earlier about the Telltale Minecraft game. I did not realize how poorly reviewed it was um, by people on Steam. Man, I want to see the word stream so bad. I had to like, no mouth, say Steam. Um, yeah, I'm going to make a diamond shovel here. Oh, I have everything I need for that. Fuck you, skeleton. Your mama. Um, man. Shovel time. Alright. I really gotta get my shit enchanted, too. Alright. Here we go. This is where we start. So people are probably wondering what happened to my Mario Maker, and the truth is, nothing planned happened to Mario Maker. I did not want to stop making those videos. Everyone was really enjoying them. They were getting more views than anything else I've been putting out. Um, I started working on, because I really, I decided that I wanted to finish my courses before doing anything else. Um, and so I really wanted level one, stage one through four, and so on. And so I'd spent, I've, I've spent, not spent, I have spent significant amount of time on my next level. And I just need to hunker down and fix the thing. Um, you know, I plan on doing a lot of stuff the last weekend, but that was whenever all my uh, audio stuff was supposed to arrive. And I was like, once I get everything set up, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to just go crazy and record a bunch of stuff. Um, but then I didn't get all the parts. I was like, wow, now I really want to wait because I know that I'm going to have better audio soon. I really want to wait and uh, get get that before, before I record anything else. Um, so that's basically what I did. I uh, waited to get the rest of, uh, of that. And I wanted to finish this ongoing series that I had as well so that there wasn't this weird um, change in audio. And I didn't actually finish Wolfenstein. I have probably have two or three more episodes I have to figure out to record. I know I'm in the last chapter right now. Um, but I haven't quite finished that game either, so, yeah. Um, so I've gotten behind on this series, too, uh, speaking of being behind on series, um, I just, uh, I don't know, just got behind, like, I, I took that one trip to the beach, 
and that kind of slowed down my production a little bit and then got back home and uh went to TwitchCon and uh I don't know, there's something wrong with me that happens in October too, and I haven't quite worked out what it is. Um which I don't want to get too far into, especially in this episode, because I don't you know, we're gonna have to wrap this up pretty quickly here. But um I don't know what it is. I mean, you guys know that I started this series in October because I was just depressed, didn't know what to do with my life, and uh didn't really have a goal anymore, um, you know, didn't didn't have a job, didn't have anywhere to go, didn't need a job, didn't know what to do, you know what I mean? Um, so, uh, and then I started talking and uh, managed to work my shit out to some degree. So, um, every October I've realized I go through a similar situation where I'm just not happy with the world and uh, I think things like compound to some degree as well like there's my god every time I'm like my nose is all fucked up right now what the fuck it's pissing me off because it's like I can hear it through the mic too so it's like I know it's being picked up this like this phlegm that's just it needs to get a fucking life um get a life phlegm uh bother someone else uh so anyways yeah, I don't know. I've tried to di self-diagnose myself. I mean, I do that a lot. Try to figure out, like, you know, why do you feel this way? Why do you think this way? Does that make sense? Um, that kind of thing. And, like, the only event in my life that comes to mind was that my dad passed away in October. But I don't feel like that's the thing. Like, I don't feel like when I talk about my dad I don't feel super sad anymore I mean it's like that's that was 12 years old at that point you know um I mean obviously I'm not super happy that he died either right but I mean I'm not like I feel like I've gotten over the mourning process you know so and like I was talking to Chad about this when I was visiting him in LA um and you know he brought up like was well, there like is it a certain temperature outside you know and it's like, oh, you know, I hadn't considered, like, that. I mean, like, I've thought about seasonal affective disorder, you know, when you're not getting enough vitamin D from the sun and blah, blah, blah. And I don't think it's that because it's, like, it's not the right time of year for that. Um, I'm still getting, you know, an adequate amount of sun and whatever. Um, so, yeah, I don't know what the fuck my deal is. But every October I go through a period of time where I don't necessarily want to talk to anyone. And that includes making videos, sadly. Sorry to say. Um, and I've noticed, I, I, I think what made me realize it more so was that when I was looking, when I made those two videos that I talked about that I never released, um, I was looking for a This Day in Minecraft to go at the end, and there wasn't any. It was like nothing. I, I did not, the only content that I made during this period of time in the last four years was, well, when it, for me starting Minecraft. Um, and then the other things are games that I can play where I'm not having to talk about my own shit. Uh, so this is it made me realize, fuck, this has been an ongoing thing, man. Fix your shit, Jason. Which I have not managed to do yet. So I don't know. I don't know what the fuck is wrong with me. Is basically the point of that story. Um, and I'm sure that there's going to be a lot of people that want to help diagnose me. And you can feel free. I'm probably not going to take your advice though, because we don't we don't know each other like that. I mean, <laughs> know each other that well, you know. <laughs> um, yeah. But anyways, needless to say, honestly, something about that trip to L.A. like uh, put me in better spirits. Maybe it's just like I need to take a vacation every October and just not. I mean, that was work though. Um. So I did have one night where on the stream I just like told everyone exactly some of the things that uh, I don't talk about because I don't think that they're entertaining and uh, some of the things that make me sad and maybe just getting that out helped. I don't fucking know, man. I do not know. Um, yeah. Anyways, you guys got like uh, the good with the fro, fro good, fro good, fro good. It sounds like um like frogo. Frozen yogurt? Is that what Frogo is? Is that what Frogo is? Is that a thing? Let's make that shit up. 
It's getting dark, man. I ain't got a bed over here. I should have a bed each. I, you know what I need to do? We're going to do an episode where we just go to each town and put like an N. Just an N at that town. Um, so, you know, when I was first making this idea, I, uh, I was going to invite a lot of people on that aren't on, aren't, aren't members of Minecraft, but they play Minecraft. Uh, that was my original plan. I actually invited a couple people and they said they would uh, be interested in doing it. And then I never actually got around to like getting them actually on the server. Let's see if this mine track actually works. I don't know if I've ridden this one, honestly. Um... But a couple of those people, I don't know if they still play Minecraft, funny enough. Everyone is, everyone that I know that plays Minecraft is stopping right now. Everyone's starting to play Ark. And truth is, I haven't really given Ark a fair chance. Um, it seemed like everyone was going to play it, and so I felt like I don't want to, it was like, okay, well, yeah, you just, goodbye. Um, <laughs> uh, it's almost like the same way I treated Survivor. Whenever the show Survivor first came out, everybody was talking about it, and so I was like, I don't want to watch it. Mm -mm. I'm not going to join your cult. <laughs> and so I didn't watch it for years. And then when I did, I felt really fucking dumb. And it's probably going to be the same with Ark, right? This game is really hard now. They've made this game very difficult. Oh my god, I'm going to fucking die. I can't die anymore. I can't die anymore. Cannot die. Don't you shoot me. You motherfucker. <laughs> That's how I really feel. God, get me in here. Shut this door up. Like Kurt. And that's going to be the end of today's guys. The day, end of the days, guys. Hope you enjoyed the days, guys. And that's the end of them. So you'll never see them again. Uh, let me know about the webcam. I don't know if it's a thing I'm going to keep. I made it really tiny uh, because I don't know. I want to feel like I'm a really tiny man. I lost weight, guys. Look at me. Uh, mainly just losing my hair. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you next time in the next episode. My goal was to get back to a Monday, Wednesday, Friday thing. Especially for those people that are donating to Game West. But I don't want you to feel like you're giving money to Game West. But I know it's going to Extra Life. And you, you, know, you're, you know what you're doing. You know you're supporting Extra Life no matter what. But I did promise you something for that money. And so I want to make sure I keep up on my end of the things. Um... And as long as I got the time and the ability, I will make these videos as long as I can. So thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you in the next one. This is this is definitely what I wanted to find, though, as far as... Oh, oh, no, 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 no! Fuck. Oh, man. <laughs> Did he explode? What happened? Oh. oh, no, he's still there. He's still there. All right, all right, here, okay. Much more successful from a distance. Look at that. That's what I'm talking about. Oh. <laughs> I thought I was hung there for a second when I saw him coming for me and I couldn't move. Oh, man. Talk about a deer in a headlight. <laughs> I could just see. Oh, yeah. There we go. Run into the lava. What's that feel? Oh, no, 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 no. Not cool, man. Not cool. Oh. Wow. Wow. That's not cool at all. <laughs> oh, man. I said if I died in my first two episodes, I was just going to quit this game. And uh, While well, I feel like quitting this game right about this second, uh, it's, it's not my intention, but man, do I feel stupid. <laughs> oh, I had my pickaxe in my hand was not prepared. I'm sure everyone saw that coming. You see me wandering down into a cave. You've all seen me play these episodes. You see how bad I am. <laughs> oh, everyone saw that coming. <sighs> and I'm not happy about this trek I have to make back to my back to my house to get my stuff back. Uh, hopefully it's still there. I've had it happen where when you get back, your stuff's not there. I don't know if that has to do with the distance you are from where you died, and maybe the chunks aren't loaded or something like that. And of course, the it's getting dark as I die. That's just my luck. Watch me die on my way back, too. That